Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Dara David and it's been such a busy month but I'm so glad I'm back and I hope you guys are as well. So in this video, I'm going to talk about how cloud computing can help your business or portfolio. I know most of us have already started working on projects or online businesses and syempre, hindi mo awala yung the fact that we have to publish it for everyone to see. Now, sa mga developers dyan or owners of small businesses or kahit students, ngayon pa lang, ay gusto ko sabihin na if you want to make your company web website, projects, portfolio, or applications public, all you need is AWS and AWS Site Sale. And if you're not familiar with those terms or with these terms such as cloud or web services, wag kayo magala kasi explain ko lahat sa inyo today. And yeah, let's get started! First, talk about what cloud means. I know most of us have heard of it but don't know what it really means. So cloud refers to services that run on the internet. So examples of those services are uh, Yahoo Mail or even Netflix. You can also define cloud as the internet because it's all of the things you can access remotely. So notice how kahit wala ka sa harap ng computer mo or kahit nasa labas ka with only your phone na access mo pa rin yung files mo, di ba? That's because it's stored on the cloud. So, nasa cloud siya lahat. Now, the field of cloud computing is so complex that I won't be able to tackle everything in this video, but the definition of the cloud is all you need to get started on AWS. So, what is Amazon Web Services and how does it differ from Amazon.com? So, yung Amazon.com, yun yung mismong online marketplace like Lazada or Shopee. Ang alam ko, wala pa tayong Amazon dito sa Pilipinas. So, sayang. Yan. But the Amazon Web Services is yun yung cloud computing platform. AWS provides the servers, storage, databases, and many more. So basically, AWS allows you to run your application on the cloud to host dynamic websites. So nandun na lahat ng kilangan mo, tools, ahat sin lahat ng kilangan mo to get your website or application functioning properly. AWS security store all your files on the cloud so you can access them from anywhere and allows you to manage databases like MySQL. So Amazon.com runs on AWS, but AWS is not limited to Amazon products. So in Twitter, Twitch, Airbnb, Coursera, and even Netflix run on AWS. Now you might ask, as a business owner, bakit ba importante yung mga cloud computing na yan? Ba't kailangan ko siyang malaman? Or ano significance sa business ko? And sa mga students, baka isipin nyo na ano bang importance sa cloud computing sa mga gagawin kong projects. Now that we're rapidly changing into the digital world, mahalaga din na nag a yung business mo, hindi lang para magkaroon siya ng online presence, pero para din maka-keep up with your competitors and work efficiently. Without cloud computing, mahirapan kayo mag-handle ng online orders especially if hindi naka-remote yung data. Now, here are some more reasons on why you should move your business or portfolio to the cloud. Number one, it provides better insights. So, cloud providers have features wherein they can give you analytics and help you target customers and product opportunities more effectively. Number two, collaboration. Dahil nga nasa cloud na lahat ng data, you can access it from anywhere, which in turn makes it easier for teams to collaborate. So we actually use cloud every day, but we don't even notice it. Number three, scalability. So the more interaction people do on your website, like ordering or sending a message, the more likely it is for servers to crash. Ang traditional way na ginagawa sa mga business, uh, nag-order sila ng mga extra servers just in case, which is a no-no kasi Sayang yung money kung hindi naman nagagamit. Sa cloud computing services, madali na lang. Kukuha ka lang ng extra server pag kailangan mo na. So, di mo na kailangan mag-alala sa scalability or flexibility ng iyong website. Wide range of options. Like I said kanina, there are so much more to cloud computing services. May mga tinatawag pa sila na paas, saas, yung mga ganun. There's so much to choose from that I know may makita kayo na fit sa business or project needs nyo. So, AWS is great for building a business or project from the bottom as it provides all the necessary tools you need or for companies need to get started on the cloud. At hindi lang yun, it's also very cost-effective to use AWS kasi meron silang tinatawag na free tier at meron din tinatawag na pay-as-you-go model. So, under AWS is AWS Lite Sale. Isa siyang virtual private server provider. So, ano naman yung virtual private server? Uh, to make a website available online kasi, it's files, lahat ng files nun, kailangan naka-upload siya sa isang 
web server. And to get a web server, kilaw mo ng web hosting. Marami kasi ng types ng hosting like shared hosting and managed hosting. So ang VPS is a different type ng hosting and it's actually the easiest way to get started on AWS for developers, students, or mga owners ng small businesses or mga users na kailangan ng solution kung paano mag-build ng application and host it on the cloud. So, ang AWS Lightsail, para talaga sa mga beginners, yung mga less experienced or yung mga bago pa lang sa cloud computing services. O kaya, para din siya sa mga developers or students na gusto mag-build ng mga simpleng web app. So, ano nga benefits ng Lightsail? Number one, it's easy to use. So, very simple lang interface and di mo masyado kailangan pag-aralan yung mga complex na concepts and procedures. So, think of it as a plug and play model. So, ganun lang siya kadaling gamitin. Number two, is affordable. Like what I said kanina, madaming plans sa pwede mong magpilian at meron din silang tinatawag na pay-as-you-go model. Number three, it has excellent support. Dahil yung um, AWS Light Sale na sa ano siya, ecosystem ng AWS, marami ka din pwedeng ma-access na iba-iba pa basta under AWS. It's also reliable and familiar. So, since ang Light Sale ay under AWS and ang AWS is such a trusted and no name in the digital world, without a doubt, hindi mo na kailangan mag-alala kasi ang dami na rin gumagamit ng AWS. And uh, the fact na marami rin gumagamit ng AWS, okay, if you have to switch or kailangan mong ipakita sa mga ibang developers yung magagabi ng AWS na light sale, ay madali na lang pag transition from one to another. Just like you, I'm still learning. Sobrang dami kong balak gawin with AWS and AWS light sale, but one thing I did to start my journey is to create an AWS account. And my advice for you is to do the same. So just go to AWS at Amazon.com and click create an AWS account. Just complete those five steps upon signing up and yun, may explore mo Amazon Web Services. But wait, there's more. They also offer free consultations. So, pwede ka may pag one-on-one -on -one call with mentors where you can ask on how to proceed o kaya how to use or guidance sa AWS or AWS Light Sale. And after you complete the consultation, pag nakita ng AWS team na qualified ka, mabibigyan ka ng free credits para hindi lang feature magamit mo at matry mo din yung mga iba't ibang premium version ng AWS and AWS Light Sale. I highly recommend you guys to join the consultation kasi lahat talaga i-answer nila lahat ng questions mo, lahat ng concerns mo, i-address nila doon. And yeah, if you're interested, go to the consultation. All you have to do is to go to bit.ly slash Darla x AWS and complete the form. As a referral code, all you have to do is to type AWS Darla. Anyone can use AWS. You don't have to be super techy or business inclined. Basta you want to try something out, AWS is ready to help you achieve what you want. It's inexpensive, very flexible, user-friendly, and has versatility to accommodate your creative ideas. And I'm so excited to see what you guys will come up with using AWS and AWS Light Sail. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys learned a lot in this video. Actually, sobrang interesting ng topic na to. Kaya, sana hindi nyo miss out yung consultation kasi it's such a great opportunity for developers and aspiring business owners just like me. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video. And wag nyo kakalimutan to check out my other social media platforms such as TikTok, Facebook page, and many more. Lahat na sa description box na. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!